Okay, we're in Huntington Beach on the Huntington Beach Pier. Carla was here a second ago. She doesn't like to be on the video. And there's, it's cold. It's, yeah, it's kind of chilly. It's chilly and there's surfers out there. Let's see, there's fishermen here. Yeah, lots of fishermen too. Waves look pretty good. But it's cold and... <laughs> Of course, they all have wetsuits, as you can see. Uh huh. Didn't quite catch. Oh, he caught it. Oh, three. Yeah. Three little. Uh -huh. We have to. I come out. Uh, my wife has business out here. And I come out just to make sure she doesn't get stabbed to death. I'm security. It's very overcast. We just had a great dinner at Avila's. Real Mexican food, not Tex-Mex junk. Yeah. You won't get a golden spoon yogurt. That looks like a good wave there. Look at that. Yeah. I mean, you wouldn't catch me dead in this water in this temperature. It's cold. See people with sweatshirts and stuff? Fishy. So it was like 30 years ago, we were walking here with my mom and my grandmother and my brother, and they're all gone. If you have all your family, you better thank God, you're blessed. Because it's no fun when you lose them. But God is good, they all sleep in Christ. Yeah. We're gonna turn around right here, right? Let's go out here. The girl used to work for me, Karen Wright, at Western Financial, she was a loan analyst. And she reported directly to Pete. He was my trader. And she lived in one of the, she owned one of those condos right there. I remember that. She was she was pretty smart. Do you remember Pete? Yes. That was smart. I hired him from Fannie Mae. Where he moved to? Like New Mexico. Yeah, somewhere. I hired him from Fannie Mae. It's a we need a trader to trade these securities. He knows what he's doing. All right, let's head back. All right, so that's where we are, Huntington Beach. Came to, uh, Carla has business in San Diego tomorrow. We'll go to LA on Wednesday. And then home, sweet home, back to my golf. <laughs> You know, I was reading about golf today, the technology they're worried about because of the ball and the clubs. They say uh, sooner or later, these guys are going to be hitting at 500 yards and, and it'll ruin the game, you know? So they're worried about that, the technology. There's some guys at the range that like they'll be hitting right next to me. You cannot believe how far they hit. I, I just... How can you hit something that far? And if I get into one, it goes pretty far, you know? Yeah. And I feel good about it. But these guys, man. <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm gonna turn her off, turn her down. So, all right. 